I don't usually dive into heavy news topics, but I do think every now and then we need to check in with what's going on in the world. Mm. That's why we're going to do a segment we're calling Sad News. <laughs> so cute. So with the help of my two lovely guests, Jim and Anthony, we're going to read some absolutely real headlines. And please, prepare yourself, because these are really very sad. <clears throat> Cue the music, please. Sad news. In Maryland, a dead goose fell out of the sky and knocked a hunter unconscious. Sad news. A woman in California had a dream that she ate her engagement ring. And she woke up to find she had eaten her engagement. <clears throat> Sad news. A bull insemination facility caught on fire, resulting in a massive explosion of semen. Sad news. A mouse launched itself into a deep fryer at a Texas fast food restaurant. <laughs> Sad news. The mayor of a New England town opened up a 50-year-old time capsule, and it was filled with nothing. <laughs> Said the town mayor, it was a big disappointment. We were all excited about it. <laughs> Sad news. The cylinders of pressurized bull semen were very... Very full of semen. So firefighters at the scene had to dodge projectile semen missiles. Delicious. <clears throat> Sad news. A man cooked a pork chop that looked like Freddie Mercury. <laughs> then he ate it. That must have been a great pork chop. <laughs> Sad news. An airport work, an airport worker, <laughs> or an air porn worker. An airport worker was fired for giving a traveler a note that said, "You're ugly." <laughs> By the way, I'm not that ugly. <laughs> Sad news. In a Virginia town, 250 escaped pigs were lured back to their pens with a trail of hot dog buns. And finally. Sad news. A Florida toilet exploded after the septic tank was struck by lightning. That's very sad. Devastating. <laughs> this has been sad news. <laughs>